Hi there, welcome to Open Farm Day and welcome to our virtual tour of Valleyside Holsteins. My name is Rebecca Archibald and I'll be showing you around our dairy farm today. My husband Alex and I both grew up on livestock farms in central Nova Scotia and in 2017 we bought my grandparents dairy farm and we started Valleyside Holsteins. Alex runs the farm day to day while I work full time off the farm in the agricultural industry and manage the accounting of the farm, helping with chores and field work in the evenings and on weekends. Our farm is located in the Stuyak Valley along the Stuyak River. Our farm is small relative to the average dairy farm in Nova Scotia, which would be closer to about 100 cows. We milk 34 purebred Holstein cows in a tie barn that was originally built on the farm 80 some years ago. A tie stall barn is an older dairy barn design that allows cows to remain in their stall with 24-7 access to water, feed, and their bed. And the milking is done right in the stall also. We have made some improvements to the stalls, lighting, and ventilation in the barn that have positively impacted the herd's comfort, health and welfare, milk production, and overall working atmosphere since we bought the farm. We milk our cows twice per day at 5 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. every day of the year. The milk goes from the cow's udder through the portable milking machine into an overhead pipeline that transports the milk around the barn above the stalls into our bulk cooling tank where the milk is stored until the milk truck comes to pick it up every second morning. All the milking equipment including the hoses, pipelines, and the bulk tank are washed and sanitized after each milking and after each bulk milk pickup to prevent bacterial contamination. Since our barn is a tie stall design, we make sure our cows get enough exercise and freedom to move around by letting them out on pasture from springtime throughout the fall months. The cows get into a routine of going outside to eat, walk, and rest in the grass, and then coming back into their stalls in the barn for milking time. In the heat of the summer months, the time spent outside may be reduced to prevent heat stress on the cows. In the barn, we have fan ventilation that help keep the cows at a more comfortable temperature, so on really hot days, they prefer to be in the barn, out of the sun, and under the fans. Even in the winter time, on milder days, we will let them out into the exercise yard for a few hours. When the cows are in the barn, they always are bedded with fresh, clean straw or shavings to keep them clean, dry, and comfortable. We feed our cows a diet of mixed forages and a grain supplement. We make all of our forage feed ourselves on about 120 acres of grass and alfalfa that we bale into round baled silage and hay. We harvest most of our acres three times each summer to produce enough bales to last us throughout the year. The silage bales are wrapped in airtight plastic film which preserves them for storage over the next several months. Based on the nutrient levels of our forage, we will work with a nutritionist to customize a grain supplement pellet to round out the cow's diet, which ensures they're getting the groceries they need to be healthy and produce quality milk. To ensure our fields have enough nutrients to produce high quality forage for our cows, we use a nutrient management plan on our farm to track soil health and crop nutrient requirements. We use fertilizer and manure to provide our soils with the nutrients they need to make the forage we need to feed our cows. There's a lot of science involved here. On our farm, just like on every other dairy farm in Canada, we follow the standards and guidelines set forth by Dairy Farmers of Canada to commit to milk quality, food safety, animal welfare, environmental sustainability, biosecurity, and animal traceability. We take pride in and we are committed to caring for our animals and our land to be able to bring your families and ours high quality and nutritionist dairy products under the Canadian Blue Cow logo. Thank you for visiting us.